Jody. And next week, on Tuesday, May 21st, my school is going on a trip to Washington, D.C. My friends and I were always excited for this trip. We knew it was coming throughout 6th, 7th grade. We would look forward to it. And now, it's finally here. Today is Friday. I got home from school a little while ago. One more weekend, and then after Monday, which will be a regular school day, on Tuesday, we will go not to the middle school where I go, but to the upper elementary school. So there's multiple many many other uh, buses because there's like pretty much 300 kids I think so my friends and I are gonna be going to the upper elementary school where there are two other buses and they wanted to do this so that there wasn't a lot of traffic so they didn't want they didn't want there to be a traffic jam at the middle school because there's five buses in total and that's that's a lot of cars of course and all the parents are bringing their kids in in the morning, but it's crazy. You know, you look forward to something. I mean, I'm going to high school next year, so, you know, this kind of thing, you know, it's, it's a fun thing to do, you know, with your friends, with your school. It's, you know, it's, it's, you know, one last, you know, fun thing to do before, you know, high school comes. So it's something very, something very cool to experience at the end of school year. Of course, it's also pretty educational. You know, we're going down to Washington, D.C. There's all kinds of stuff. Museums, uh, monuments. Um, pretty sure we're going to the White House. I, we're not going in the White House, but I'm pretty sure we're taking pictures outside the White House. There's many other cool things, and I'm, I'm pretty excited. Um, we. We all get our own hotel rooms. Um, a, a specific group of students get their own chaperone. Um, it's interesting because the each group, you know, they're in a hotel room and they have the hotel room to them to themselves. I've been far from home before. I was young and I don't remember. So this is the farthest away from home that I've ever been in quite a while. And I think, you know, there is quite a lot to do. It's going to be hot down there, lots of walking. But I've heard from the teachers who are organizing this that it's going to be a fun experience. Um, lots to do, lots to look at. Uh, and I decided to make this to document everything that goes on down there. Because obviously this is happening for like four days. I'm not even going to be away for four days straight. I'm going to be here on Tuesday, and I'm going to be here on Friday. So literally, there's only two full days where I'm not here in my hometown. It's just... This... You know, it, it just seems like a while that you have to wait for something like this. But then when it eventually comes, it, it, it just goes by so quickly because you're having so much fun. And then when it's done, you're like... Oh, 
I wish that could last forever, you know? I have this for my friends and I to look back on. My friends are, my friends are pretty excited. Weekend, probably even today, maybe. I'm going to be packing a suitcase with all my stuff. And then, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how everything goes. Yeah, there's a bunch of, bunch of cool stuff going on down there. Not sure what my favorite's gonna be. They've given us a schedule, so we'll see. So in a room, I'm pretty sure you either bunk with three people, or if you get permission, you can bunk with four people. But I'm pretty sure five people is the max for one hotel room. I'm bunking with my three friends, Duncan, just tear your sleep. That's jingling, oh, ding, ding, jingling. Hunter. Kill the dragon, and then another one comes. No, stop! Stop bringing more dragons into Dungeons and Dragons. And Troy. And I have bodyguards Loki. everywhere. Loki. Yeah, Loki. Loki. Bodyguards everywhere. Just bodyguards. I No. I have guards everywhere. Okay. I cast L charm person L on him. Joey, this is my impression of you. <laughs> Duncan and Hunter are both in the upcoming Kidnapper film. Both will be in the infected, even though, you know, it's only been like maybe around three years that I've known Duncan and Hunter, but I feel like it's, you know, it's been a while and we've had lots of good times and, you know, we always knew, I always knew Duncan and Hunter would, would be in my DC group, I knew it. Um, there, we had one other person, he's in a different group. Then along came Troy, boom, Troy's in our group. And we're very glad to have him. Um, they're just, they're all great people. They're all funny. They're all cool to be around. They're good friends. We do all kinds of stuff together. We make movies, short films. We make, we write books together. I'm writing an epic fantasy series with Duncan. I'm writing a horror novel with Hunter. Actually, we're gonna be writing our horror novel on the bus. Because the bus ride to DC is pretty long, you know? It's like somewhere between eight, somewhere between seven and 10 hours. Some other people were saying, oh no, it's like 14 hours. No, it's, no wait, it's 14 hours. I mean, I, I always thought it was like 10 hours, but then I kind of looked it up. It was like maybe like around seven, eight hours. But I mean, there's gonna be like a lot of like stopping and stuff. Every two hours we stop. I know we're getting food on the way, so it's like, it's not just seven or eight hours. It's probably a bit more, but between seven and ten. So there's gonna be a lot going on in the bus. I know it's a different kind of bus, not the regular school. I'm probably gonna download something, show, movie that Hunter and I can watch. Hunter and I are big Stranger Things fans. You, you can bring DVDs for the bus, but they have to be rated PG. Well, I'm not... I think that's because they have TVs that they're going to play movies on on the bus. Um, I think that's what they meant it for. So that, you know, if everyone's going to watch it, it'd be great. If it's just Hunter and I watching it on, like, my phone or something, or my iPad, if I download it, who cares? Um, but we love Stranger Things. I'm probably going to download Lord of the Rings or something. I'm going to be bringing books to read. Um, I'm going to be rereading Stephen King, uh, Pet Cemetery by Stephen King. Hunter has read Stephen King, we're, uh, we're, I think he's sort of a Stephen King fan. He's read a couple of his books, he says they're really good. He's reading The Shining right now, but he has read Pet Cemetery. he's seen the movie, it's one of his favorite movies, and we're, of course, going to be writing our horror novel on the bus, so. He's also, while I'm, while we, you know, take a break from that, while I read, um, he's gonna write a Dungeons and Dragons campaign. We're both nerds, but... I'm pretty happy about that, because nerds, they, they like a lot of different things. Look at, look at, look at all these books. See all these books? Mm-hmm. Yep, I like to read. Which, I mean, of course, definitely, I'm going to be bringing books to DC, you know? Okay, Hunter. So, we have the DC trip coming up, and I'm going to interview you. I do not have a microphone. I have a pencil, so I'm going to use... The pencil. Okay, um, are you looking forward to the trip? Yes. How much are you looking forward to the trip? Like, on a scale of 1 to 10. 10? Because we've been wanting to do this since last year. Boop. 
Yep, since last year. Um, what, um, what, what place in DC are you, are you most looking forward to seeing, visiting? The dinner cruise thing. Oh, the dinner cruise on the Odyssey? Yes. It's gonna be cool? Yes. Definitely. And the room. Oh, and the room. That's cool, right? We yeah. Get, get our own room. We get to hang out after... What are you gonna watch on the TV in the room? Stranger Things. Oh. Oh. Uh, let's see. Are you excited to write our book on the bus? Yes. What's it called? The Man with the Lunchbox. It's gonna be so cool, right? Yeah. A lot of walking, though. I agree. You got your suitcase packed yet? No. <laughs> I'm gonna pack it tomorrow. Yay! And Monday. And Monday? And then Tuesday, for breakfast, we're going to Buckley's. You going to Buckley's? Yummy. I'm probably just getting waffles. Yummy! <laughs> All right, it is May 20th. It is about six, I think it's like 6.45. At this time, in 12 hours, we, we will be on the road. Okay, so I just woke up. It is pretty early, so that's why I'm whispering. All right, so I'm gonna do a few things. Okay. Hey, I just took a shower. Um, so now I am going to have breakfast, brush my teeth, and I'm going to just walk out the door and go uh go aboard the bus. So yeah, we'll be be there pretty soon. That's a video. Hi. Hunter, are you excited? Yes. Are you really excited? Yes. Duncan, what about you? Are you excited? Yeah. Is that the bus? Is that the bus behind you? Woo! Joey, it's it's an airplane on wheels. It's an airplane on wheels. Hey, that we're waiting on the fourth person in our group, Troy, but he's on his way. He's what did you say you were gonna do to me? We're gonna put you in the bottom of the bus. What did you say? Are you doing? Are you I'm gonna put you in there. Are you gonna put me in there? What you got there? It's a, it's a headdress. Hershey. Alright guys. Hey Hunter. Hey, we're, we're on the bus. We're on the bus. We're on the bus. Look. Look at this. You can put your, your Dunkin' Donuts there. Hey Parker. Hello. Are, you, are we going to DC? No. I, oh, I'm pretty sure we're going to DC. No. Yeah, we're going to DC. Hi Abbott. We're going to DC? Yeah, we're going to DC. Did you not know that? You thought this was the stay at home? No, we're going to DC. We're going to DC. Are you guys excited? Are you excited for DC? Yeah!
plane with no wheels. A plane with no wheels. I mean, no wing. I mean, with wheels. What are you eating? M&M's. Hunter, Hunter, Hunter. They're playing video games. Hey guys, you playing video games? You guys playing video games? Cool. Hey, Duncan. Brenton. What happened? What is that? What is that? Are you eating these? Why is it open? Hunter, why is it open? I don't know. Did you like did you like the M&Ms I gave you? Yeah. We're almost in Connecticut. Seven seven hours and fifteen minutes left. You're playing what? War. You're playing war? Oh, okay, so we're not actually in Connecticut yet. We're still in Massachusetts, but did you say we're almost to Connecticut? Yeah. Where's Connecticut? I don't know if see it. Right here. Right there? Okay. Yeah. I think in 15 minutes, we're going to stop for a uh, break. Um, they said we're stopping every, like, two hours, I think is what they said. Every two hours. Yeah, 14 minutes until we're in you guys like war? You guys like war? Yeah, I'm winning. winning. She's only won one war. Yes. So one of the things that we say we were gonna do on the bus was Stranger Things predictions for season five, which is coming out. I think 2025 or something. Yeah. I wanted it to come out at the end of this year, but they gotta edit and stuff. It's they're gonna and the writers strike has. and the writers strike. They're gonna finish. They're probably gonna finish filming at the end of this year, but they're not gonna finish editing. So maybe 2025 spring. I don't know. Hopefully sooner. So we are, we love Stranger Things, don't we? Yes. So we're just gonna have a little discussion about some of our theories. All right. He's won. It's like six to one in the world. Yeah, yeah. You want another one? Yeah. Yes. Are you destroying him? Yeah. Yes. So we know we know the first episode of season five is going to be called The Crawl. Hunter, tell us why do you think the first episode is going to be called The Crawl? Well, maybe Max is crawling back to life. Max. Max is crawling back to life. That's that's definitely a possibility. So Max, the character, spoiler alert, if you haven't gotten to season four, she is in a coma after pretty much she dies and then for like a minute and then she comes back to life because of Eleven and her superpowers. And so this show is so nerdy. Um, but she's in a coma and we think, Hunter thinks, the first episode's called The Crawl because it's her crawling back to life or something. Maybe she wakes up at the end of the episode, I don't know. Because I don't really want Max to be in a coma for the whole season or like for maybe most of the season. And then she comes, you know, she awakes maybe towards the ending. I want her to wake up either over the course of maybe like after a few episodes or maybe like at the end of the first one. That would be the perfect way, maybe to end the the last episode. But we know they play D and D in this show, and I looked it up. I forget what it was. I know that the crawl has to do something with Dungeons and Dragons. Like the crawl is, I believe, like a. Uh, I forget. You play Dungeons and Dragons. Do you know what the crawl means? No. Oh, okay. He's looking it up. A dungeon crawl. Which is okay, so a dungeon crawl, which is a scenario in fantasy role playing games where players explore a labyrinth and battle monsters, solve puzzles, and avoid traps. The name dungeon crawl refers to the maze like environment and the slow, steady way players must move through it. Okay, there we go. This is gonna be cool, right? Yeah. Who do you think is gonna die? Uh, you want another one? Yeah. You want another war? I think 11. You think 11 is gonna die? Uh, she might sacrifice herself. Do you think Max is gonna die? Possibly. Okay, here's the thing. It's gonna be sort of like Game of Thrones. None of the characters in Stranger Things are safe. Here's the thing. So obviously, they're not gonna kill a majority of them. Of them. I'm thinking they're probably gonna kill maybe at least two or three major characters. Another war. Wait, what do I do? <laughs> two hours down. 
really two hours? Yeah. I won war. Wait, what? We're in Connecticut. We're in Connecticut? We're in Connecticut? Yes. Are you sure? What does that thing say? Are we really in Connecticut? This is the borderline. And then like, some of New York. Are you excited to see the White House today? Yes, yes, I am very excited to see the White House today. That is the only thing we're doing. We're, I think we're, where are we going for dinner? Like the Pentagon? Uh, yeah, Pentagon. The, pe the Pentagon City Mo uh, food, 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 food Court. Food court yeah, food cool. Court. And then we're going, a little wa walking around, going to the, to the White House. Um, take pictures there. Then we go back to the hotel rooms. Go to bed, wake we up. We have dinner, and then we go to the White House, and then we go to the rooms. Yeah, I have a schedule somewhere. Oh wait, you know what? I don't have the schedule on me. It's in the suitcase um, under the bus. All right. So you think Steve could die in Stranger Things season five? Yep. Show us the timer. That's a smart idea. I kind of want to stand. You kind of want to stand? Yeah, I want to stretch my legs. So we've been we've been in here for like about two hours. You just got a power school notification. Um, uh oh. So we're about to take a a break, stretch our legs, go to the bathroom and stuff. So. Duncan, what you doing? I'm playing Mario Galaxy. So we, we went outside, we stretched our legs, we met some other friends. We're back on the bus and we're waiting for everybody to come back, so I guess we're just gonna do whatever. Wanna talk about Stranger Things? Yeah. <laughs> um, what do you think like the main subplot's gonna be? Like obviously Vecna's not dead, they gotta kill Vecna, right? So what are they gonna do? They're gonna fight a bunch of Demogorgons and Demo Dogs. Yeah. I'm sure there's gonna be lots of Demogorgons in this season. And, and the Mind Flayer. Okay. I'm and Vecna. Is, the Mind Flayer is dead, right? No, no, no. The Mind Flayer is trapped in the Upside Down, but it's not dead. Didn't Vecna, Vecna created the... Wait, you guys watching... You guys watching on Twitter? We're talking about, talking about, talking about, about it. Hey, guys, how's it going? Give me some Sour Patch Kids. I don't have any more Sour Patch Kids. He doesn't have any more Sour Patch Kids. Um, they just, like, started playing a movie on this, like, TV here. What do you think we're watching? I think we're watching The Sandlot. What do you think? Yes. Have you ever seen The Sandlot? No. Is The Shining on HBO? The Shining? It used to be on HBO. They took it off? Yeah, they took it off. I'm gonna, work on, I'm gonna work on our book. Are you reading the book? Yeah. So I did. I wrote like 30 pages so that you can read that and approve of it. And then we're gonna continue writing the book. What's this? Wait, we're, what is this? The city. Do you want me to check the map? Yeah, check the map. I think this is like Hartford. Hartford? Where's Hartford? Connecticut, right? Yeah, it's Hartford. It's Hartford. Connecticut. Connecticut. Capital. Oh, we're in the capital of Connecticut? What'd you say? We're in New York. Wait, actually? We just entered New York, you silly goose. Cool. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to go. E.T. 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 Four hours and 36 minutes. Four hours Whoa. and down to my last three brain points. You gotta be kidding. The bus is uh, stopping again. Yes. We're in New York. <laughs> We're in. We're not in New York City. We're but we're in the state of New York, I believe. Troy, Pierce says hi. Hi. We just hit five hours.
what did you say? We're crossing the Hudson River. New what? York City. What river? The Hudson River? Is that New York City? Yeah, New York, York City over there. It's very silly. Way over there. You can't really see it. Yeah, but it's right it's way down there. What did we just pass by? Circus wheel. Circus wheel. Circus wheel. Circus wheel. Circus wheel. Circus wheel. Hey Hunter, what are we watching now? Watch the Caribbean. Do you like this movie? What? Do you like this movie? Yes. And uh, uh pretty pretty soon we're gonna be stopping for lunch. You got your lunch money? Yeah. Abraham Lincoln. It's Abraham Lincoln. Yay! And them Chick fil A sandwiches, boys. We're in a Chick fil A. Chick -fil -A. We're in Chick -fil -A. The workers are not paid enough. Hey, Logan. Mm. You know how much that costs? Why? I'm bringing on bus. What? I am. Yeah. What'd you get? No. We got fries, <laughs> fried rice, and uh, teriyaki chicken. Pickle. Yummy! Pickle. With a side of invisible me? water. That's that is definitely invisible and not already drunken. Hello, Troy. Hello. What you get? I got uh, I got a napkin. Whoa. I got potato Whoa. with the little box. <laughs> and I also got that Chick-fil-A sauce. Chick-fil-A sauce? I got jamming. And Joey got a sandwich. Yummy. Well, are you excited? I bet you Tyler is playing Brawl Stars. He's very excited for the DC. Guys, we need some water. Uh, Hunter has joined us. I thought, you, I thought you were about to say Hunter has joints. No, Hunter, Hunter has joined us. The thing is, I asked for a BLT, and I heard her say something else, and I said no, but that was to lettuce. So now I just have bacon and cheese. Oh, it's yeah. Lettuce? Do you like that lettuce? Lettuce. You like lettuce? Lettuce. How's your panda express? Very good. <laughs> how are you? Good. How how was your food? Hey, Duncan, give me some. Delicious. What are you doing? <laughs> Drinking. Is that good lemonade? Yeah. Oh. No. All right. Uh, so my name's Wesley. I'm really excited for DC. I got a six-inch sandwich. <laughs> so we are done eating. I got Chick Fil A. He got Subway. Then we just like went to a building with a bunch of just a bunch of like random restaurants. It was like, quite overwhelming. There were like people everywhere. But um, what did you do? Carter. So there were there were people everywhere. I went and I sat with a few friends that I knew. Now we're, we're back on the bus. Hunter, you bought a few, a few things, right? What'd you buy? Uno. 20, 20 bucks. How does Uno go for 20 bucks? Guys, guys, how was lunch? Amazing. How was lunch? Delicious. Delicious? What's this? Uno for a few hours, I'm down. Me too. Fire. It will last just a while. Yeah. What time are we at? Almost eight hours since we've left. Whoa. <laughs> Alright. It, it, it has been a while. Are you any good at shuffling? No, I'm not that good at shuffling. We're playing Uno. Oh my god, this is so What'd you take from us? Whoa. Joey. <laughs> what? Look. I'm so small now.
Jack Sparrow. Yeah, Captain Jack Sparrow. Captain Jack Sparrow. One minute. What'd you say? Two hours. Where, wait, where are we? In Maryland. So Hunter, the, so we're going into Washington D.C. Yeah. And, the, and the movie that we're watching, they're in Washington D.C. <laughs> What's this? Oh, we're gonna go there tomorrow. The National Archives. Or Thursday, I forget. Wait, we're going to the National Archives building. Yeah. Hey Troy. Uh, how is the bus ride so far? Make a funny face. No. I have it. I are you excited? Yes. Imagine not being excited for Washington D.C. Yeah, imagine. Hunter, these guys. Oh wait, which one? Which which river is this? We just got the victory! Viennese, we're so good, we're so good. My victory for what? Uh, Minecraft Dungeons. Minecraft Dungeons, we pushed that game. Uh, what's Minecraft Dungeons? Oh, I see. Good yeah, job. Minecraft, when you go into a dungeon and defeat the monsters in the dungeon. Good job. We're in the final stretch, men. One hour and 55 minutes. Oh, wow, that's the length of, uh, of, of, of the first Back to the Future movie, I think. Yeah. Hello, I'm here with Jack Chapman. Hi. I'm How do you here. like the trip so far? I'm tired. You're, I want to sleep. You're tired? Yeah. We're, we're almost to DC. Are you excited? Yeah. I've heard from like 30 different people that they, they, I look like I'm dead. You're probably just tired, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty exhausting. What you got there? It's Bigelow Me! It's Bigelow Me! So there was like some random kid who was like trying to buy something and I I actually thought he was Pierce. And so I like went up to him and I was like recording and I said, Pierce, you're not, you know you're not supposed to buy anything. You just go to the bathroom and you get back in the bus. And it wasn't Pierce and I felt like so awkward, you know what I mean? You look like Bilbo Baggins. Okay. What? You look like um, Bilbo Baggins. I look like Okay, what does it give me for this one? Uh, Bilbo Baggins? What? Do I look like Bilbo Baggins? Uh, yeah. Oh. Okay. The 
We're about to eat dinner. Yum yum in my tum tum. Have you? Ah! Uh, scary. Touchy. Hi guys. Hi Ashley. Guys, dripping up. Hi. How's the pizza? Fire. All right. So this mall is like this mall is crazy. So not only is it packed with all the kids going to DC for my school, but there's a bunch of other schools here. So yeah, hold on. Gina, tell us your name and what you're excited about. See, si, see, si, my name. It's Dimitri Demarcus, the baby on Jameson Junior the third. You know your name is Azure. No. Asher, are you excited? Yeah! Do you like escalators? I love escalators! What's that? What's that, Hunter? What's that on your head? Money hat. Money hat? <laughs> Alright, a little recap. A little recap of what was going on in the, uh, the, in the food court over here at the mall. Very overwhelming, lots of people. I met up with some friends, I had a few slices of pizza, I had a milkshake. I went around socializing, and for a majority of it, I was just like wandering around, figuring out, figuring out what to eat, because there were stuff everywhere. Right, Hunter? 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 There was like there was people everywhere. But now um, we went outside and we waited for everyone else to come out. I was talking with a little group of my friends. We were talking, having fun, laughing, joking, you know, having a good time. Now we're back in the bus. I'm I'm in the I'm in the window seat. We're going to the White House, right? So what do you think, Hunter? You got a Washington DC hat with uh, whatever that guy is on it? It's a nice souvenir, right? Yes. Was it worth the money? Oops. What'd you do? What? Oh, okay. Alright. Oh, it does go back. You think it was worth the money? Uh, maybe. Yes. Maybe? Yes. It's a, good sou it's a good souvenir, I think. I mean, the little Nike inflatable thingies aren't worth the money. They're $45, like. Who's gonna spend what, what was that hat that you saw? Donald Trump? <laughs> yeah, it was a Donald Trump hat. It was like the red one, and then it had hair. It had hair. The yellow hair. Like the Donald hair. Trump yellow hair. Yes. That's silly. I should have gone. They have to give us the room keys at the hotel, which I thought they were gonna hand them out at the place. So now it's gonna be crazy. And it's, yeah. Let's just do nothing. All right, I think we're still going to the White House, even though we're, we're literally like more than an hour and a half late because of traffic. So it's almost eight. We're gonna go to the hotel, and then we're gonna go to the not the hotel. We're gonna go to the White House, then we're gonna go to the hotel. But like the milkshake was so filling. Uh, pizza was decent. Like, just pizza. I'm not a biggest pizza guy, but well, it depends on the pizza. But I don't really care. It's fine. I actually honestly really wasn't that hungry because we ate a bunch of snacks on the bus. I honestly really wasn't that hungry. He spent like forty dollars on this hat. On snacks, he said, not the hat. The hat was twenty bucks. It's not bad. Yeah, it's true. Everything's expensive.
look at this. Whoa, what is this building? Is this like a court thing? What's this? It's the Department of Treasury. The Department of Treasury? Oh, nice. Who is ready to see the White House? Are you excited to see the White House? Yes, please. Skylar, are you excited to see the White House? Yes. I have never been this far from home. This is where our money came from. Where they print the money. Oh, that's cool. They print the money there. <laughs> is this the White House? This is the White House. All right. I think. Look at all these kids. Why are there? There's just too many. There's just too many. Is this the White House over here? Is that the White House? This isn't like the... Is that the White House? <laughs> Uh, what are you even doing? Uh, 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 even got like a little fountain there. Uh, 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 this, this is the White House. Which is weird. Wait, dude. The president's not here, right? No, yeah. The president. Then why do you do caravan cars? Where are they protesting? Oh, those aren't the reinforcements. How did I just Is this the White House? There's snipers on the roof. Look for them. I don't see any snipers. One second. I I know where they are. I don't see snipers. You would have a full drone in this area. I don't see any snipers. Hi there. Do you like the White House? What's the White House? What's the White House? That thing right there. That's the White House? I thought that was the bank. That is not the bank, that is the White House. Scott, do you like the White House? Is it cool? What's the White House? Do you like the White House? No! No! You like the White House? Thank God we left Merrimack in time for Joe Biden. Oh, we got the Duggan, Duggan, did you like the White House? It was epic. Good. I did, love the White House. Did we even take a picture? We, they, did they take a picture or no? Yeah, they, yeah, they took pictures. They took panoramas. Oh, they took pictures? They panoramas. Oh, okay. All right. Give me your money. That is the um the treasury the treasury. And I do not think you want to take money from them, or you could be in serious trouble. A million dollars. You're not taking a million dollars from the Secretary of Treasury building. I want a million dollars. I do like that statue, though, in the front. That's nice. Two and seven. We have a room keys, and we're going to the hotel room now. Okay. It's been 14 hours since we've left Merrimack. 14 hours. We're over here waiting at the elevators. Look at this hotel. This is the inside. Oh god. What is this place? I'm scared to drop my phone. I'm not that close to the little railing over there, but I'm still 
We're still... Whoa! Okay, so I'm in room 340. Okay, I don't know where that is. Oh, there's Troy! Hey, Troy. Oh, I'm coming. Hey guys, welcome to the room. Hello. Can you yeah. hold the door? Yeah, I can hold the door. It's Are you recording so too? Nice yeah. Like, look, look at this interior. Like, look at that. Like, look how like um, awesome that is. It feels like we're outside when we're. It's in. like our, we're outside because like when you look at that, it's like I don't know. Hi, I'm over there. Dude, that's so cool. Let's all. Let's all so all when whenever the door locks, it. Whenever the door, when you shut the door, it automatically locks, right? So we don't have to worry about locking it from the inside. Okay, so I'm whispering because it seems they're sleeping. Um, they're all over there in the same room. I have the whole, like, main area and the couch and the TV to myself. I've just been reading a bit of Pet Cemetery by Stephen King. It's a really good book. Hi, Hunter. Hi. First morning. Yep. What are we doing today? We're doing a few things. It's gonna be cool, right? Yeah. An 80 year old man. I'm never gonna eat breakfast. We're in the hotel. Guys, guys, oh, guys oh. ready? I'm blasting Lee shop music. Guys, ready? I'm an, I'm an, I'm an old man. Ready? Breakfast. Breakfast. Hey, Christian. Hey, Christian. Coffee. Give me your coffee. Do you like your coffee? Yes. Cool. How are you doing? Uh, decent now that I've had three cups of coffee. Good. There's a, there was there used to be a very long line. Uh, drink, no, no, no. Uh, Do you have a little Okay. What's that? Hot chocolate. What hot chocolate? With cream? Is it yummy? Um, I don't know. I haven't tasted it yet. I'll get back uh, to you when I get Okay. Whoa, look at this place. What do you think of the food? Do you think the food was good? Um, pretty basic, but yeah, I think the, the hash browns were really good. They were made, they were made really well. I really liked the food. Yeah. I like the sausages. The place is cool. I did, the line actually moved faster than I thought. We were able to eat in time, and now we have a. Now we have like twenty minutes to just relax. Cool. Well, actually, like ten minutes. But like, yeah, no, but that's not that bad. I just gotta brush my teeth, and then we're gonna get in the bus. Yeah, I'm gonna go put some special. All right, wait, wait. Do you wanna give us a room tour? Give us a room tour. Ready? Sure. All right, ready. Duncan's giving a room tour, you guys. 
Alright. Running boy. So, this is the living room. We got sort of kitchen area, you know, bathroom. This is where I slept. And um, it was very nice sleep. Over here is our illegal substance and is toxic waste. No, it is not illegal, it's just candy. It's just candy. But it's, it's very sour candy. A chew. This is why it's called toxic waste. All right. All right, and what do we have in here? Clo closet and a safe. And iron. Um. Yep. Sink area. Well, there's one sink in the bathroom, but this is like a sink where you get water. Because there's nowhere else to get water. And then this is for ice. Um. And then we got a fridge. With iced tea and get ready. And coffee and a microwave. <laughs> to make popcorn. Microwave coffee. Microwave coffee? What? There I am, I am, there I am, yep, I am there, um, chair, um, where I was reading Pet Cemetery last night. Pet Cemetery is all alone over there, don't worry bud, I'll finish you today. Oh, Hunter's here. I'll be me with, meet up with everybody, and we're gonna go on the buses. And where are we going first? I forget. I think the Arlington Cemetery, maybe. Uh. Oh. Hey, hey, hey! Come on, we gotta go. Go to the buses. Oh yeah, Joey. Guess what I did? What? Me and Abbott bro, used the elevators to go all the way. To, we pressed all the buttons. Okay, we're gonna go on the bus again. Oh, See what happens from here. Yeah. Okay. I think it's a metaphor, okay. but I don't know what. Hey, Logan. We're on a, we're on a, uh, tour.
soldier. Once you are um, done visiting, you'll come meet us right back where we are dropping you off here. Yeah. So as we head back to the Welcome Center, I do want to tell you all a little bit about the history of Arlington and how it became the cemetery that you are seeing here today. So the section that we are going to drive by here on your driver's side is Section 13. It's one of the oldest sections here at Arlington. Family from ever returning. On the passenger side, we're going to go by the structure here, the James Tanner Amphitheater. This is where our nation held its first decoration royal day right now. And then you may also be able to see on the driver's side, there's a cannon over there. That is a brave marker for the first U.S. Chief of Artillery, Wallace Fitz Randolph. He requested to be laid to rest under one of the weapons he had spent his whole life fighting behind the war on the property. 
Now as we look by, you may have seen the flag lowered to half staff. Here at Arlington, our flag lowers to half staff 30 minutes before the first funeral of the day, and then it raises back to full staff 30 minutes following the last funeral of the day. On weekdays, we have these blooming in between crosses marking graves on the battlefield. These were the only things that would grow on the battlefield. Now I know you all got a chance to visit rest here at Arlington was our 27th President William Howard Taft, Turkey driver side. Now also to the left of the walkways for the Taft, you'll see this one marker two rows back has five stars in a circle on it. That is for the last five-star general, Omar Bradley. He served in World War II, commanded the highest number of troops uh, in military history, more than 1.3 million troops during World War II. He was known as the GI's general. So the care and respect he gave his men and was given in return. Now I know I pointed it out a little bit earlier, but as we head back through these gates coming up on your driver's side, you'll be getting that gorgeous view of the Lincoln Memorial again. Now the bridge that you are going to see that will lead up to the Lincoln Memorial, we call it the Avenue of Heroes, as it is the last journey that many of our service members take before being laid to rest here at Arlington. And that's that view right here on your driver's side. So as we do head back to the Welcome Center, I want to thank you all so much for joining us here at Other Stories with you here today. So once we do head back into the Welcome Center, I do ask that you all will continue to... Um, it was, it was, it was good. It was, it was, it was kind of sad. It, 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 it is. It, it was, is. It was good. It was it's informational. Very, it, it is very sad, but it, it's just very historical. It's very historical, but it's sad. And we got these as souvenirs. Wait, what do these have to do with again? Oh, poppies, because poppies always grew where the soldiers had died. Uh, so with all of these uh, little flowers, I see that you're heavily honoring the, the U.S. military. No, actually, kind of. I mean, the, the first one I was fine with it, and then people started giving me all of them, and I started placing them on my tangled hair, and I can't get them out. Oh, so yeah. They're stuck in my hair, but sure. Are you recording? Yeah. Hi. You should do the spider man. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Hi. Hey, hi. Joey. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Done looking at the Arlington National Cemetery. Obviously, sad place, but historical. Um, of course, the the what was it the, the the tomb of the un, of the unnamed soldier was that what it was unknown unnamed unknown uh, unknown. I'll look it up. That was cool though. I've heard of it. I've never seen it in person though. I tried to get some good footage of it, some close ups. Um, that's cool. His voice, though, scares me. Does it scare you? What? No. Really? Does he be yelling at me? Yeah. He's tough. There. Exactly. That's what a lot of them look like. Like this.
going to the Smithsonian Museum of Natural History. Are you excited? What did she say? There was like a one of Abraham Lincoln's hats. Something about C-3PO. The slippers from the Wizard of Oz. Yeah, I guess we'll see. See how much we can uh, look at. We're not going to be there forever. Look up. I got a burger. Oh my god. Ah. Oh, that is so good. What'd you get? Burger? Burger. Duncan, you got chicken nuggets, uh, tenders? Chicken tenders! You should look you... up. What? Look up. Put the camera up. Oh. Oh wow. That, that's great. That's like, that's like my, my 15th favorite movie. It says I'm so bad. I'm dying. That's cool. Hey Christian. What's up? What'd you get? Um, I got mac and cheese mm. and uh, fries. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yum, yum, yum. This is cool, right? Then that's what I want to do. Dude, what's this? Birds. That big boy. That big old boy. Giant squid. You can't do nothing with this. Uh, I found this bamboo and it's like, it's got this pan inside. I don't know what to do with it. You can do it again. You can see what the stairs are warped because people walk on them so Dude. Dougie, where are we right now? We're at the Natural History Museum. Smithsonian Museum. Dude. Smithsonian. Look at that elephant. This look is crazy. Look at, that. look at all these like different like rooms and stuff. Geology. Geology. Uh, elephant Discovery Station. They got the Hope Diamond. The Hope, Hope. They got the Hope Diamond. I'm pretty sure that's like a really big diamond or something. Oh, cool. Humans have wondered where do we come from forever. How did? We... The mental, the core, and the crust. They don't got the inner or outer core. Just the core. <laughs> Hey, is it working? Hey, hey. Restart maybe? No, nothing. Back up, oh, not working. Oh, that's a shame. Does that work? Um, why is the USA in the middle? The USA goes here. I don't know, dude. No, there's literally a map back there. Kobe, Japan. What? What was that? I don't like this thing. Oh. Well, what is it doing? What is it doing? Oh, it's showing the shockwave that happened. Oh, the shockwave. How it's going around the earth. Of the earthquake? Oh, look, it bounces off the outer core. 
and creates a brief shockwave. That's a shockwave. That's the, that, that's crazy. That's so cool. Dude, look how far that's traveling around the Earth. Wow. Uh, that's traveling the entirety of the Earth. Like until like here-ish is how far it gets down. Oh, oh, is it gonna hit? It hit the whole freaking Earth. Look at this, like we got Afophilite, Phenogene, um, Afrodidablucious. This sounds like stuff you find in your food that you don't know. <laughs> oh crap, it's sort of like a hexagonal or pentagonal shape. I'm just waiting for a tire to come out of there. And hit you in the head. Yeah, I'm not. like it's a rock with a hole in it. Do you think I could fit in there? Yeah, you can probably in there. We close it up, you know, ship you off to Mexico. How did we end up over here? I, I have no idea. Is this part? This this does not have the elephant in the in here. So where's the elephant? Where's the lobby? What? Do we just like teleport? Because we keep going into like different like random rooms, and we end up like on the other side of the building. This feels like a specific level of Luigi's Mansion. Yeah, dude. How do they have this much gold concentrated here? Oh, are those the ones that taste like salt? I think. Maybe. Are those the ones that taste like salt? Okay, Duncan, that rock, I don't know why. It looks cool. It looks it like. It does. It's, it's freaking topaz. Topaz it always looks cool. looks like it has like a wig. I don't know. It does not matter what color topaz is. Topaz is always cool. I like it when like rocks are opened up Celestite. like that. Celestite. Celestite. That's, 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 that's a cool name. It's a video game. Really? It kind of looks like meat. That does look like raw meat though. It does look like raw meat. That looks like more diamond ore. These balls look like I could just go up to them and go, Ooh, magic crystal balls, help me the future! Woo! Dude, that look, at, is look at that. Yep. We're back over here. Um, Where else should we go? Live butterf live butterflies. Live butterflies. Dude, I feel so small and so big at the same time looking over the same room. Because this, this is like a really cool effect. I mean, it, it's, it's about the same size, I would say. Maybe a bit, probably a bit smaller though. Yeah. Butterflies. They need like a ticket or something. We need like, a, we need like a ticket to go see the butterflies, so. No we're, we're, we're finding someone else to do. We're gonna. Uh, we're we're, finding we're gonna find our other friends. Dude, these stairs look so fancy. I've been trying. Like, I tried. You found us. We've been looking for you. You've been looking for us. The weather on that that line. You feel the weathering in the steps. Look at that. Pretty cool. Sicily Joey. It's above the, uh, what's it called? Oh, cool. So we got elevators. <gasps> it's the cafeteria. We were just over here. That's just the way that it shoots. There's an upstairs cafeteria that we didn't know about. Wait, 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 oh, wait, what? Another cafeteria? If I quote unquote accidentally drop this from this height, would I get in trouble? Yes. yes. If I drop my phone, I, what, I would. Like I would be. This is leaning. Like it, it feels like when we go over, I'm already leaning. Uh, this is making me nervous. Uh, uh, I just Hunter just got back to me. Hunter's in the main lobby. I also like Let's that chart. Let's go down chart. one floor and check out that cafe area. Yeah. Uh, Dude. No, oh, I do not like I elevators. Guys, where did the elevator? Where did the elevator go? Um, I, I, I don't want to. There is glass. You can see oh through. It's scary. No, no, that's sca it's scary. It's, it's scary though. Joey, I promise. I promise. I wish you guys. Not Wait,
we we lost Duncan and we're trying to look for him. He ran off last time we found him. If I was Duncan, where would I be? GameStop. Uh, I'm gonna use my Duncan sense. This way. I'm sending a psychological link. I will find you, Duncan. All right, we are in a different museum, the Smithsonian uh, Museum of American. American History, not Natural History. And Duncan ran off on us again, so we're gonna try and find him again, right? Yeah. Hey, Jack. Jack, look behind you. Hey, Jack. How are you like an escalator? He's good. Dude, if it wasn't for Joey, I wouldn't have found you. I wouldn't have found you. Yeah. Show us what you're doing. I'm making a lightsaber, a double-sided one. Nice. Guys, we found Duncan. Right, Jay? We yeah, found we Duncan. Found What's up? We have lost Duncan again. What are you doing? That's cool. Okay. Well, you got more money. What do you mean? How much Jack, did you start with? Exercise. What? How much did you start with? One point. Bro, what am I on? 
How are you enjoying DC so far? Pretty good, pretty good. What was your uh, favorite The only part? thing that's keeping me sane so far is my uh, music. Good job. And me, right? um, Thank God for your music. Probably the best part about this, I would have to say the museums we just museums visited. Museums are awesome. I think the cruise is going to be great, though. Oh, the cruise is going to oh, be yeah. awesome. I'm going to get some good shots. I'm excited for the cruise. Okay. I'm excited for the cruise. Yeah. It's going to be awesome. excited for the cruise. Me Definitely too. Excited. What about the museum? Do you like the museums? Mm -hmm. Where are we? For dinner. 
This is crazy. Oh, this is kind of fun. You like it? Yeah. Boat, 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 boat. Do you like the boat? Yeah. Dang it. Do you like the boat? The boat is silly. The cookies, the cookies are so we good. We love the cookies. They're delicious. No, the boat be, the boat be wild enough. They're so good. Chris, do you like the boat? Do you like the view at least? Uh, the view is nice. Yeah, the view is nice. Water. I won't. I won't. 
Nolan, do you like the boat? No. I love this silly boat, it's so silly. I like the boat. Was it good? I only had cookies, so yes. Oh yeah! Do you yeah. like the view? <laughs> it looks great. Wave to the boat. Hi. Um, great view, right? Yeah, beautiful. If you go on the other side, there's a sunset. Looks like right. better.
then we're turning away from the bridge. We're not gonna go under the bridge. Are you under? Are you I thought we were gonna go into one of the spokes. Are you are you are you Rose from the Titanic? Quite possibly. No, nah, not he Jack. But I thought Jack was Jack. Uh no. No, nah, nah, Jack's clearly Rose. Oh, <laughs> We got back to the room, things were chaotic, but we went to sleep eventually. Uh, we played some video games. In the morning, we, of course, we went down to the buffet, we got some food, and then we went up to a friend's apartment because they allowed people to visit other rooms. So we hung out with some friends. Um, and then some other friends joined us. I didn't really film anything last night. We just played video games. I'm probably gonna read on the bus. Yeah. All the way down. Yes, I did too because I wasn't here. So, uh, um, I didn't look at the schedule. I don't know where we're going. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I do know where we're going. We're going to a memorial for 9 11. So, we're going to be going to that. Um, and then I forget what else is after that. But I think today we're going to the Capitol. Today we're going to the Capitol building. Definitely. Um, yeah. Cool. Do you like the DC trip? Yep. Chris, do you like the memorial? Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like all the waterfalls. 
Yeah, I like, cool. I like this guy. How are you enjoying the trip so far? Good. Good. What was your favorite part so far? The Franklin Delaware Roosevelt, uh, like memorial. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Lots of rocks and water boats. Yeah. interviewing us. Uh, what was your favorite part of the trip so far? Um, breakfast. Breakfast, yeah. Yeah, oh. breakfast. The hotel, the hotel. Yeah, yeah. The hotel's nice. Yeah. Did you like the cruise or no? Hey Justin, how did you like the dinner cruise? The dinner cruise was awesome. The food was good. Really good. Did you like the views outside the boat? Yeah, it was awesome. It was awesome. Do you like the, what's your favorite part of the trip so far? Probably the cruise. It was fun. A lot of people said that the food is mid and that they didn't really like it. Uh, no. No, it was no, absolutely- I, I had a migraine the entire yeah, time. Yeah, same. It was awful. Yeah, it was terrible. Do you like the memorials? Uh, I guess. Yeah, they're alright. Good. You know, like they said it was boring and like someone went online and it was like two stars. I mean, honestly, it was actually pretty good, but- Yeah. The only thing I didn't like was um, the, um, the food at the- um, Hotel, the like the breakfast. Yeah. Some of the food is actually horrible. What like the eggs? Yeah. The egg wasn't that good. Would you rather be at school right now? No. Hi, Asher. Hi. Love this Stay thing. Italian. It's it. You gotta love the detail on this thing. It's great. It's very good detail, right? It is. I overheard uh, Mr. Bozeman talking about how it's meant to look unfinished because of just like the fact that everything is like. Yeah. Wait, what was your favorite part of the trip so far? Probably this place. This place is, you know, nice. This is this is actually this is a very nice place. I like, I like the detail that was put into that statue. Yeah, the detail the detail was pretty good. Martin Luther King Jr. The one thing I don't like is that I don't know where the bread group is right now. Yeah, for photos, right? Are you excited? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I guess I'm excited a bit. <laughs> Duncan, where are we going next? I don't know. Capitol building. Are you excited for the Capitol building? Yes. What are we about to go see? I don't know. The Capitol! The Capitol! Oh. Wait, well, where is the Capitol located? It's over there. Right there. Ashley, do you like the Capitol? Oh,
Jack. Could you go, go over there and ride on the horse? And you should be uh, Aragorn, son of Aragorn. Uh, G Gandalf's horse is Shadow Fox. Shadow. Shadow Fox. Show them the meaning of haste. Hey, Pierce. Hey, Pierce, where are we right now? Pierce, what's that over there? It was hot, man. Ferris wheel. What? Ferris wheel. Ferris wheel? Yeah, it's hot. Pierce, do you want to know? That's not the Ferris wheel. What is that? What is that? It's a Ferris wheel. No, the thing behind it. The building. The building. Yeah, what's the building called? It's called the building of buildings. What? Um, I'm trying to think. Pierce. I'm just a bill, yes I'm only a bill, and I'm sitting here on Capitol Hill. Burner. I'm just a bill, yeah, I'm just a bill, and I'm sitting right here on Capitol Hill. We're not on Capitol Hill right now, are we, technically? It's over there, right? No, uh Hey Duncan, yeah. sing the Bill song. I'm just a Bill sitting up on Capitol Hill. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, that's a, oh, wow, we're close. Are we going on a tour? I think so. Are we going on a tour? Carter, are you excited? Yes. Wait, where are we going? Uh, Capitol. I'm pretty what? sure. Yeah, we're going inside. Know. We're going inside. After we had gone through security, we made our way into the Capitol building and down the stairs into this this large room filled with people. Duncan, we are inside the Capitol. Slurpy, slurpy. Yeah. Are you excited? For what? The tour Ooh. of the Capitol. We're doing a tour? Yeah, I, th I think so. They said there, they said there was a guided tour. Oh, well, that's cool. Yep. I like the Capitol. Hello. Do you like that? I am a fan, yes. And then we went on a tour throughout the Capitol building. First, we went to this cool looking room filled with statues. And then we made our way up into the iconic dome of the Capitol building, which I was just amazed. The architecture was phenomenal and it was huge.
Fountain. All right, I'm in the Washington DC Botanical, Botanical or Botanic? One of those uh, gardens. Um, I'm up on the highest floor that I possibly can reach. Um, downstairs, it's nice and cool. Up here, it is sweaty. It's, this is, this is pretty cool. Oh, yep, just plants everywhere. Hey, Brenton. Hello. Is it sweaty up here? Cool. I'm gonna go now. Okay. Wow, there's a little bridge over there with the water. This is cool. I'm gonna go back down the stairs where it's actually like cold. Or not cold, but air conditioning. What am I doing? Yeah. I don't know, I'm just exploring. What's this? I got some stuff from DC, you wanna see? Or from uh, the Capitol building. Some souvenirs. All right, I got a, uh, what's, what, uh, Declaration of Independence and a uh, US Capitol pin. Oh, 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 <laughs> what did you see that? Did you see that? It almost went through. Actually, it probably wouldn't fit. Hello. Hello. Hi, guys. Hi. Three or four minutes. I don't like elevators. This one's just plain slow. I don't like this elevator. It's okay. Because it's a window. Take your time. You can go down to your time. It's a scenic group. Take your time. What, what did you do? Mist Towers. The what? The Mist Towers. The Mist Towers? Yeah. Ben, I'm a little wet, as you can tell. Where are we? I don't know. We're in the National Archives building. Whoa. Um, I believe the Constitution is here and the Declaration of Independence. I found out that I'm a DJ. Pierce, do you want to go see the Constitution? What? Do you want to see the Constitution? Uh. Isn't this crazy? This is crazy. Did 
you see the Constitution yet? Uh, no. It's over there. Yes. I. It was awesome. Whoa. We get to see the Washington Monument. Let's go. All right, so we are done looking at the National Archives building. Duncan, tell them a funny story about your milkshake. Okay, so I order this milkshake. The dude says eight bucks. I hand him eight bucks. He hands me the eight bucks back, hands me the milkshake, and hands me two more dollars. I made a prof. I made a profit on this. All right, so we went to the National Archives. Uh, that was cool. We walked around a bit. Some of my friends got ice cream. Um, we hung out a bit. Bye bye, Capitol Building. And now we're back on the bus and we are going to the Pentagon City Mall food court again for dinner. And then I think we're gonna go take a look at some, some memorials, some monuments. I think we're going to the Washington one and the Lincoln one. So, really cool. Hey Duncan, what oh, memorial is this? Um, Air Force Memorial. Look, look at my hat. Joey's got the Air Force oh. hat. Hi Logan. Hi Joey. What's your favorite memorial so far? I don't want this. I don't want this. Can you have it back? I don't want this. I don't want that. I um, knew it. I'm waiting for the Lincoln Memorial. The Lincoln Memorial is going to be my favorite. Oh, okay. Well, t you tell us then. Huh? You'll tell us then? Yeah, I'll tell you that. Okay. <laughs> Who's that? Who's that guy? Let me see that guy. Okay. He's a handsome man. Yeah. Lee, what was your favorite part of the day so far? Uh, <clears throat> Hey, what was your favorite uh, part of the day so far? Part of the day? Uh, I don't know. That's the hard one. There was a lot of cool memorials. Do you like this memorial? Yeah, it's really cool. It's the Air Force Memorial. Look, Air Force. Hey. Yes? What you eating? Um, McDonald's. I managed to get in the front of the line when I... Opens. Wow, very healthy. Yeah. <laughs> what you eating? Chipotle. I knew it was Chipotle. I knew it. Is Chipotle good? Very good. This is my first time ever having it. Wow. Cool. That looks good. How much was it? And you're getting cheesesteaks, just like me. I love this. So good. And Asher, Asher just got like chicken. I don't know. Hey Jack. Hold on. What you eating? Uh, a quesadilla with rice and beans. Whoa, it's yummy. Yeah. Dude, I aspire to be you. Hey, Chris, you make a mess over there? Uh, minor inconvenience, but yeah. You know, I feel like it's fine that I spill my coke. It's not even like it. I, I like lemonade. I don't know why. I got the craziest drip. Monty Python hoodie. Boston Red Sox hat. Minecraft hat hat with the U.S. Constitution. We the people. Asher, how is it? That's some great job. Ah, it! All I paid for this was my sweat, blood, and some hard earned Where do you get it? We the people of the United States <laughs> We, the people of the United States, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves. Did you take my hat? No. You took my hat, didn't you? No. You took my hat? No. Yes, you did. No. You can't deny it. No. Okay. You took my hat. No, I didn't. See? Oh. Where'd my hat go? Okay, fine. You didn't take... Is that my hat? It's my hat. 
Goodbye. We're done eating at the um, done eating at the Pentagon City Food Food Court thing. Hung out with some friends, and now we're just gonna go see a bunch of memorials and some monuments. We got glow sticks. We're gonna go look at a whole bunch of different memorials and walk around in the dark. Yeah, it's so fun. So fun. Lincoln Memorial. Lincoln Memorial. See that? I believe the nuclear bomb shelter for the president is below us. Oh, okay, yeah. that's nice. And that might have the codes to launch bombs also. But, yeah. I don't know. Do you like Lincoln's memorial? Yes, but the only qualm I have with it is that Megatron isn't sitting on this throne. Because in the movies, Megatron destroys Lincoln off of his throne and starts, like, sitting on the throne. So, that's my only qualm, is yeah. that Megatron isn't on that throne. Is this your favorite, or, or which one is your favorite memorial? This is probably my favorite, yeah, I love this. I love Abraham Lincoln. This is a great memorial. I saw this memorial on a penny, and when I was in kindergarten, I said to my kindergarten teacher, is this a jail cell? <laughs> hey guys. Yo, it's him. Looks <laughs> good. Did you go to see Lincoln? Sure Isn't did. this a great view? Look. It is a great view. That is such a great view. Washington Monument, I believe. Oh yeah. Hi Logan. I love <laughs> <laughs> I found you. <laughs> you don't care about it that much. Okay. Hi Abbott. What's oh, that? that's a smart idea. What's Doug that over there? Ducky. So Washington Memorial. Ducky. Wait, wait. Ducky. Can you frame it so that I'm holding it? Oh yeah. Um. Yep. And take a photo. Wait, wait. Duncan! Okay, Jack. I miss you. I miss you too. Wait, wait, can I see you? Real quick. No. I no, I want to show you. I actually got some stickers. Truck, truck. Oh. Ah! Oh, that's great. I love brothers. How are you enjoying the trip so far? It's great. What's your favorite part? Favorite part is hide and seek at night. Oh, oh yeah. And what's that behind you? That's the cool fountain. It's pretty cool, right? Yep. Bye, Bye, Joey. Have a good night. You too. Yes.
Um, we're going down the elevator. This is the last time we're going downstairs to the buffet, right? Yeah. Because today we are leaving the hotel and we're going to the zoo. Where's everybody getting in the chug jugs, bro? What? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Yummy coffee. Yeah, I know. All right, so has it been a fun trip so far? Or yeah. we're pretty much about done? Yeah. We got one more place to go, and what is that? The zoo. The zoo. Nice. Oh, good. What's up? What was your favorite part of the, the trip so far before we go to the zoo? Uh, my favorite part was probably like the Lincoln Memorial. The Lincoln Memorial? It, it was fun. It was just kind of relaxing there. You That's know? cool. Abraham Lincoln was cool. I love Abraham Lincoln. He's awesome. Hunter, where are we going? Uh, the National Park. Today's the last day. Yeah. We're going to the zoo. I like elephants. I like flamingos. Flamingos! It looks like a chinchilla. It's Joey. What is Joey, it? that's you. It's me? It's you. I like those guys. What's a lemur? Right, it's not showing its face. Oh, oh, hello. I see him. Look at the creature. I like him. Okay, I changed my mind. That's Joey. That's not me. That is you. That is not me. There are so many Joeys in here. That's not me, though. What is that thing? I don't know. Hi.
Oh my god, wait, that doesn't look adorable. Skylar, where are we? Look at that thing. It's so cute. Hello, little creature. Okay, I like that guy. Oh, I see it. He's up there. Hi. He's oh. up there. Oh, there. You can tell they're happy here. I like that. Yeah, they are. What is bro doing? Oh, okay. yeah, yes. Thank you. Bro. What, what's bro doing? I found you. You found all the way. You found it. You found it. Wow. Okay. Wow. It's <laughs> I love them. Oh, uh -huh, he's scary. Guys, there's a new board. Okay. I gotta get close. Hi Liam. Yeah, what's up? How was the zoo? Dude, pretty good. What's that? It's a character. This is uh, Logan Fabonio with his new fedora. That's me with the curly hair. And that's Emma Smith, bro. Cool. How much was it? Not that much, like 50 bucks. That's actually really cool. I know. For It's pretty good drawing, too. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. It you was put like, that on your wall? Yep, definitely. Cool. I think it was like 80, like 80 in color, so... I, yeah. Uh, that that was just way too much for me. Yeah. How's the ice cream? Good. You're sad? Well, we're gonna go home now. Are you excited to go home? Yes. You're excited but sad? Yes. What do you think of the trip? Did you think the trip was awesome? Yeah. Abbott. Did you like the trip? Yeah, that was, was fun. Are you excited to go home? Yeah. I'm sleep in my own bed. Yeah. Did you like the trip? Yeah. Duncan. Hey Duncan, are you excited to go home? Yes. Yeah. Did you like the trip, Duncan? Low key real. Yeah. Go. 
I'm not, I'm tired. Wow, it's so dark we can't even see. We're on the bus. Um, it is like almost 11. Yeah. Um, but we're we're in Massachusetts and we're we'll, we'll be in New Hampshire soon, I think. Right? Yeah. Are you excited to go home? Yeah. The trip was fun, but we're exhausted, right? We, we can barely see ourselves. It's so dark. I don't want to use the flashlight because I don't want to annoy anybody, but yeah, we'll be home soon. Bye bye. Well, that's it. That was the DC trip. It's like, it's like it, it seems just like yesterday when we, when we were on our way to Washington, DC, but at the same time, it, it just feels like it was so long ago because we did so many things, you know? It was, it was a very good experience, and I know I'll always remember it, but... I'm very glad that I went on this trip. Well, I guess that's just, it's really all I have to say, so... My name is Joey. I'm signing off.